Hi there guys, how's it going? This is uh, Matt Dutomalt here and welcome back to some more Airport City Free to Fly. Today we're just going to have a quick discussion about the uh, the latest uh, the latest event that's just passed, the latest quest, sorry. Uh, the It came from outer space, so already I posted a couple of like um, summary, sort of like um, preview videos and uh, what the actual event is going to be like and today we're just going to have a quick summary of the, uh, the actual event because uh, it has now finished. Unfortunately, uh, I didn't actually complete it. Um, I fell a little bit short. Uh, let me just show you over here. Uh, let's go to event. Oh, great. The menus aren't showing up. The game has had a couple of bugs lately. I don't know what's been going on. Uh, I think maybe because they've been implementing a few updates, because uh, they made some alterations to the quest before it started and things like that, it made the game a little bit... Uh, well, it caused a few issues with the game, but uh, I came a little bit short on the Some Like It Hop uh, mission where you had to fly to Area 51 and pick up uh, these items. Uh, I only managed to complete that collection once, whereas it needed to be completed four times. I managed to complete the rest. Uh, I managed to complete the UFOs and things like that. I managed to pull that one off, but unfortunately uh, I wasn't able to, uh, to complete the Some Like It Hot West. Let me just try and find it here. Uh, there we go, there we go. So there's some like it hot quest. And as you can see, I've got a lot of items here. The problem was, I was able to fly to Area 51 quite often uh, because I actually ended up with four fighter jets. I managed to complete the above and beyond quite often. I got four fighter jets. I've since sold them off because I don't need them anymore. Um, but the problem was, it was yielding me items, but it wasn't yielding me the right ones. As you can see, I've got 9965 over here of these ones. But it was this one over here that just never ever dropped and it really really annoyed me because that was the one I missed out on because I managed to complete the flying saucer nine times, managed to complete the stargate three times, almost ended up with the uh, crop circle out of that as well. Uh, and yeah, so in the end I failed by, it was almost a near miss you could call it. So yeah, I didn't manage to complete it. Uh, I felt that the mission was quite good. Um, I certainly would have hoped to have completed it, but of course, um, unfortunately, this uh, this some like it hot ended up hindering me. In terms of actually how the mission was built, um, I think it was okay. Although I do think that they perhaps made the some like it hot one a little bit too hard. Um, Maybe if they would have said complete it twice, it might have been a little bit more achievable, which, although to me, wouldn't have made any difference because I didn't get the heat resistant barrel in the end. Uh, but if they would have said, like, complete it twice, it might have been a bit easier uh, because already it was quite difficult to get the items for the uh, the fighter jet. I felt, that, I felt that was quite difficult. But then it's a challenge, and eventually I did get them, so it was okay. I don't mind that. Um, and then possibly... I mean, if they can find any way of balancing like the yields, because to get like nine, eight, seven of other items and then not get any of another is is quite annoying. And it's it's just uh, in general actually, because as you can see on most collections, I've got one item missing, and yet other items I've got like twenty four of them and things like that. You can see that it's a, a problem throughout, and um, perhaps maybe a balancing might actually help. Even though they're all meant to be seldom, uh, they're all meant to be like the same yield frequency, they're actually not. And I reckon that's something they might want to improve on. Um, I'm quite excited though because the Halloween event is coming next. I, th I think it's the Halloween one, well logically it is. Um, and that's a really good quest, I remember it. I've never completed it but uh, I know it's a really good quest because I've had a go at it a couple of times when I was just first starting out in the game. Of course when you first start out it's really hard. Um, but I really like the Halloween quest, so I'm looking forward to that one. Um, so I'll be posting a video about that as well. Uh, we'll have a look at what we've got to do and things like that. And yeah, it's it, overall that um, that recent quest was okay. I felt it was quite interesting. Um, I've never tried it before, um, so yeah, to get 85% out of it was okay. I felt I still felt it could have been better, but. Um, unfortunately it wasn't to be. Uh, so there we go then, so that's it for now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for Airport City Free to Fly, with myself, Matt Tomato. Thanks for watching guys.